Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to potentially remove the pop-up from the notification area here for media that you haven't been playing. So let's say you're working on a particular website or on a document or something and you click on your notification area here on the volume icon then you can see you have this little box here showing you what video is playing which is which is over here and there's no way to exit out of here or close it without closing the actual page you're on here. So this fix will be for web browsers not for other things like Windows Media Player because you can get this as well when you're using Windows Media Player. So we have a couple of adjustments here that you could do for Chrome and Edge. I haven't looked into how to clear it for uh, Windows Media Player. I think there's a Windhawk mod that will do that so I'll have to check that out. All right, so depending on your browser here. So let's say for Chrome, I'm going to go to this flag here, so we'll copy this, paste it in the address bar here. And you want to change this hardware media key handling to disabled, and then relaunch. All right, so so far it's gone. So it seems to be working so far because sometimes you could close the browser and then reopen it up, start your video, and it's still not going to show up there. So I'm not sure exactly what triggers it to show up here, but I've been trying this for a little bit. And so far it's working, so I will say it's not going to be guaranteed. It's not going to come back, but it's uh, worth a shot. And then for Edge, do the same thing. Copy this. Open up Edge. Paste it in there. Same thing. Restart it. All right, let's just try this uh, video over here real quick. All right, so far it's gone from there too for Edge. All right, so once again, just pick your browser, you know, Chrome or Edge. Uh, there might be these available for Firefox or other browsers, but like I said, I haven't looked into that because uh, I use mainly Chrome or Edge. So I will put these in the description, and then you can try it out for yourself and see if it fixes the problem for you. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.